And welcome back to North of the Broad. With me now are two guests from Holy Trinity Classical Christian School. We have Celeste Pruitt. She is a director of advancement for the school. And then we also have Abigail, who is the events coordinator, because we're talking about a big event that's going to be happening on October the 16th. It is the Swing Bridge Run. So welcome, ladies. Thank you. Thank you for having me. Excited to be here. Yeah. Let's go back to this event and give us a little history okay. about it. I think you said it's the third year and a little back background about it's the why. It's the third year on the bridge and it was actually started by families several years ago. We would uh, gather on the Spanish Moss Trail as a school community and in 2019 we first gathered on the bridge downtown uh, and opened it up to the entire community. That was a very successful event. Uh, Unfortunately, last year, yeah, we had to go to a virtual uh, race because of COVID, but I have to tell you that was incredibly successful. We still really? had tremendous response from the community. Uh, we had people participating from all over the country, uh, winners from Texas. Uh, so, so that was fantastic. And we did uh, keep the virtual piece of the race mm -hmm. this year. Abby mm -hmm. will talk about that. Um, we're very, very excited to be back on the bridge this year. And um, we are thrilled with the community uh, response to the race. Holy Trinity has received a lot of community support through the years, haven't mm -hmm. they? It absolutely it's, has. It's mm -hmm. just amazing. It's very exciting. So let's get down to the details yeah. of the walk and the run uh, October 16th. Yeah, so can absolutely. You tell us about it? Yeah, this event is really exciting because it's really a culmination of working with the community through sponsorship, hosting an event for the community, for our families, as well as just the broader Beaufort community. Mm -hmm. um, so for us, it was really important to um, start the day with prayer. So we're having a sunrise community prayer gathering on the waterfront facing the bridge. It's going to be beautiful. That's a 7.15 that morning, starting bright and early before the run. Um, just a, a short time to gather together. Yes. Um, and then we'll have various options. We have a timed Swing Bridge 5K run mm -hmm. for our true runners out there mm -hmm. who just love some exercise. And then for people more like myself who like the <laughs> leisure, we have the All Ages Bridge Walk, which is another registration option, something for families or just people who want to show up and be together with everyone. It's a shorter route, walking across the bridge in the morning. It's going to be really beautiful and then we are we're bringing the virtual option back as well um, so that way it's a uh, an option for people that are connected to the school but live farther away who want to support the vision and um, it, this event really allows us to continue to offer um, accessible and affordable education here in Beaufort um, and this event is crucial to that happening so it's really exciting so if someone wants to be involved whether they want to walk or run or just be a an observer yeah yeah. What, you know, what What do we do? Where yeah. do we register? Yeah, that's a great question. So the practical side of it is um, we have our own website, swingbridgerun.com. Okay. Super simple. Um, and then we're using a platform called runsignup.com. You just Google the Swing Bridge Run there, and that's where our registration options are. There's lots of information about all the aspects of it. A little more information about the school for people who are curious. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um and yeah, so it's pretty straightforward and it just has our options there and you can sign up, get a t-shirt if you want, all the above, yeah. <laughs> what about any vendors, food or music or anything like that? I mean, I know it's we're focused on the run and the walk, yeah. but will mm -hmm. there be other things happening? Yeah, so the main purpose is to kind of start the day and end the morning right in downtown Beaufort. So um, the main event is really the prayer gathering before okay. and um, then we're encouraging families to just spend the, the morning in Beaufort together. We really want this to be an event for families okay. um, that's so close to our hearts. So um, we're encouraging them to start their Saturday morning together and Perfect. then yeah, visit local businesses, eat yes. out in town and support Perfect. community businesses. Um, so yeah, we're excited about that. Mm -hmm. So Celeste, um, the last time we talked, mm -hmm. if we're gonna switch gears here a yeah. second, mm -hmm. You all are in the fundraising mode mm -hmm. for expansion of the school. So where are you? You know, how's it do? How's it going? Oh, it's going very well. I'm looking forward to hopefully announcing a groundbreaking date, maybe after uh, the holiday break. Um, we have a goal of $6 million and we are at 5.7 right now. So we're very close to that goal. Um, the Swing Bridge Run does support the Holy Trinity Fund, and that's our biggest fundraiser year after year. And that's what makes uh, a Holy Trinity education accessible right. and affordable to more families. 
Um, and the campaign that you mentioned is uh, to build and expand our campus. Right. Mm -hmm. Very good. I know mm -hmm. Reverend Lawrence is on a sabbatical right now. He'll mm -hmm. be back. Yes. We're looking forward to seeing him again and, and interviewing him and talking more about the great work that you're doing in Holy Trinity for mm -hmm. the students in their classical education. Mm -hmm. Thank you, ladies. Thank and you for having us. It's going to be a great event. I'm really I'm excited for it. Yeah. And thank, thank you, you so all much. for joining us on North of the Broad. And we'll see you next time. Bye, everyone.